Hey, Shalom Akim, Yahweh Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Ba'ashem, Dab Honors and Salutations to Elders and Apostles of the Mystery of the World, from Nashi DC Camp, with another short lesson, a spell prophecy of this end times that we currently living in, man, because, uh, in the, you know, we're going to get uh, uncomfortable as uh, things get difficult, but our faith is going to work strong in the name of the Lord, Yahweh Shai. So I just have a quick video just want to show the Akiam concerning the signs you're going to be seeing the heavens in these last days. All right. Uh, yeah, just make sure that uh, you pray the Lord, the Abba Shema Shah keeps you strong in, in your faith because uh, we're going to be entering into some dark times. So I'll play the video, shows you some uh, some so-called meteor, meteor <laughs> across the sky. And uh, just uh, let just a reminder that uh, we're getting close, man, to the time of Jacob's trouble. You know, getting close to the downfall of Babylon. You know, getting close to the, to the end of Esau's rulership and the beginning of uh, of Jacob's. All right, that's the time that we're going into. All right, more pain and uh, adversity and tribulation. So I'll play this video and I get a quick preset from the book of Acts, the second, second chapter, because it's all prophecies that have to take place. You see that right there? Yes, just that's all, just across the sky, man. Yes, it's, it's a scary, and it's scary to see things like this to the ordinary mind. But for those that are spiritually minded, you understand what uh, what is taking place, man. That the Lord Abba Shema Shah has given his prophets a sign that uh, he's on his way back. Okay, so this is Acts chapter two, verse sixteen. But this is that which was spoken by the prophets. Joel, okay, and it shall come to pass in the last days, said Lord Yahweh, I will pour out my spirit upon all flesh, and your sons and your daughters shall prophesy, and your young men shall see visions, and your old men shall dream dreams. So, this is just a part of it. All right, I can have had several dreams and visions of. Uh, Signs in the heavens, okay, about the child of the Lord Yahweh Shema Shai, seeing the Lord Yahweh Shai come with his angels, seeing brothers and their families being delivered, seeing the downfall of Babylon. Those are all visions from the Lord Yahweh Shema Shai. Verse 18 And all my servants and on my handmaidens I will pour out in those days of in those days of my spirit and they shall prophesy all right the verse 19 says and i will shew wonders in heaven above and signs in the earth beneath blood and fire and vapor of smoke the sun shall be turned into darkness and the moon into blood before the great and notable day of the lord Yahweh come uh, come all right and then verse 21 says, And it shall come to pass that whosoever right, of the nation of Israel shall call on the name of the Lord, now by Hashem, Yahushua, by Hashem, shall be saved. And that's exactly, you know, what uh, I hope and pray for that I can that preach the gospel and the families get delivered because uh, it's scary, man, to see these things take place. You know, to some people it looks entertaining, to a lot of people it looks entertaining. But for the men of the Lord, man, you know, we go into a period that uh, it's going to be uncomfortable. But at the end of the day, man, you know, you shouldn't be nervous. You know, you shouldn't uh, be stressed out, man. You just have to understand that uh, we have to go through this difficult time. All right, we don't want to uh, fall. <laughs> 
you know, by the wayside. You got to complete this journey. All right. You don't want to be the, the uh, ungrateful servant. All right. You got to learn to use your talents. And, uh, you know, I appreciate the value of the gift that the Lord Abba Shema Shah has given you. So just, just upon the Akim, you know, just uh, make sure that, uh, you know, you stay faithful in the last days, man. Because uh, it's, uh, these are strange, strange sights. All right, strange things to look, you know, to look upon these last days, Shalom.